How you doing, bro? Good to see you back. Thank you. And we worried about you. A warm welcome back for an officer who'd been out for a week and a half. Yes, sir. <laughs> I appreciate all y'all. Good deal, man. Appreciate you. Yes, you hang in there. Deputy Nolan Williams walks down the hallway of the Jasper County Sheriff's Office. Though he walks with a limp, he's lucky to be standing. While we were talking to him, that's when he decided to make a run for it, I guess. Joseph Gary Johnson made a run from Deputy Williams and his partner last Saturday. The partner pulled Johnson over on FM 105 near Evadale because a light was out on his license plate. Williams came as backup. They learned Johnson was AWOL and the military had a warrant for his arrest. Deputy Williams said he was standing here between the driver's seat and the door when Johnson started the car and took off. My feet came out from underneath me and then I just pushed away to try to keep from getting run over. And that's when I felt the pain in my leg. Williams grabbed Johnson and held on. Johnson sped away and dragged the deputy several feet. The tires ran over Williams' right foot. Williams finally let go and fell to the ground. Johnson was later arrested in Silsby after he crashed into two light poles at the end of a 100 mile an hour chase. I wish I could go back today. <laughs> I would be back right now. I miss patrol a lot. He won't be able to go back to patrol until his torn ligaments and severely sprained foot heal. Until then, he's on light duty. I'm not angry. I forgive him, and I hope that I hope that he can forgive himself, and I hope that he can move on and do right. I wish it wouldn't have happened that way, because I would have much rather liked to have helped him than anything. And that's what I'm here for. I don't, I don't, we're not here just to be mean and lock up bad people. We try to help people. That's why we do this job. A job helping people, <laughs> serving beside those who have helped him. I just wanted to say thank you to all my fellow officers and my sheriff and my chief that were really there for me and helped me and are helping me now. Helping him get back on his feet, moving forward one step at a time. In Jasper, Megan Dillard, KFDM 6 News.